Hello everyone, what is going on? My name is Adobe Warrior and welcome back to my K-pop reaction channel. I post new K-pop reaction videos here every single day, so if you like this video and want to see more videos like this, make sure you check out some other stuff on the channel, and if you like what you see, maybe consider subscribing and sticking around. Um, today, I'm very excited because I'm going to continue reacting to EXID's title tracks. A um, uh, little bit of context, I had never heard EXID at all until Me and You. Um, and then I end up also doing an album reaction, which I typically do for new releases if I like the title track. So, loved the loved me and you. I loved a lot of the B sides. Really, really, really impressed with the the vocal talent, the overall, um, the just how how high production everything was. You guys said they do a lot of the writing, especially their rapper, um, L E. Yeah, I, like I said, I think I've I I'm terrible with names, but um I think it was like Le, um who who does a lot of the the songwriting, which is really cool. Um and then I was like, okay, I'm gonna do their title tracks in order. Shout out to Kinney who commented and gave me a chronological release list. Um so to make this just a little bit easier for me, I already reacted to Who's That Girl, which was their debut with the six members before they split. Um, and I did like that, but it definitely felt completely different, and I wasn't sure if that was because it was, you know, seven years ago, or if that was because it was, like, or if it was because it's half a different group. Um, and so I was really curious, and then I just reacted to I Feel Good, and, uh, yeah, I Feel Good was most definitely, uh... The reason, like, that I instantly felt, uh, like there was an identity that was present in both I Feel Good and Me and You that wasn't in Who's That Girl. So, um, yeah, I'm really excited. This is, like, definitely more, I definitely liked I Feel Good and Me and You more than Who's That Girl. Because it just, this, this felt less, it felt less unique to me. Um, which, once again, debuts can, but... I'm I'm feeling good about <laughs> I shouldn't have made that joke. Anyway, I am going to react to every night now. Uh Yeah, this is their first one that I Well, no, that's not true, never mind. Ooh, it's a 15. Or oh, oh, I like dark concepts. Uh I'm excited. I'm even more excited now. We got like uh a sketchy looking place. That phone. Pretty vocals. <laughs> they censored booty call in the. Sorry, it's just it's funny to me. Um. I really like how they came on this. It's like, I wasn't sure what type of song this would be from just that that guitar and the little da 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 da. Um, but once the vocals start, it's got. I, I like this flavor a lot. Also, they look really, really good in these matching. Ooh. They censor the word booty as they're doing that. <laughs> nice captions. <laughs> That's very funny to me. We can't we can't use that word, guys. They might see that word, and it might make them think about butts, which you can see five of moving provocatively right now. Ooh. Oh my gosh, that pan though. Jeez, that. I'm not even gonna make it through this video. That's really hot. And the vocals, too. The, like, more so than. Like, don't get me wrong. I am. I I love me some sexy, vis, some sexy visuals, some sexy choreo. I like the dark concept a lot. Um, although the music isn't dark, it's got, like, a, like a lighter. Um, like a lighter vocal tone, but it's a 
the lyrics are like this, uh, you know, they're very, um, very the same tone as the video, which is not the same tone as what I'm hearing, which is cool. Um, but what I was saying is the, the tone of the voice, the vocal delivery is very sexy. Even though the instrumental is not... Okay, the instrumental is sexy now, never mind. Maybe it was, and I just have no idea what I'm talking about. Oh, rejected. I have no idea what's going on, but this is oddly satisfying to watch. Whatever liquid that is going into vials. Okay, that bass is making this instrumental very sexy. Oh, it's a booty call. Hence the the phone ringing. Stop the dude to do. Ah! Oh my gosh. The Never mind the whole song sexy. I don't know what I was thinking earlier. I think it was that bass component that was making me not feel that right away. Oh my gosh. Just that simple, simple rotating with the hip movement with somebody in front. It's so... Ooh, I hear it. That's like a, someone tapping on a, a pot or a pan. It's like a that... I like that a lot for percussion. Uh, something's going on in the blender. My gosh, pan shots. What's with the creepy doll, too? I didn't just notice it, I just keep forgetting to ask about it. Wait, what'd she forget? Sorry, I rewind a lot. Oh, she was him. Oh, she took the one. Oh. Just the mm, so so much um v like flavor in the voice. <laughs> I don't know what's going on here, to be honest. Did they just put a sneeze in the song? Shots. Slow mo spinning out liquid. Ooh, the Adler. What? I'm so confused about the video, I'm sorry. Ooh. Just the constant, ridiculously good ad lib. We're in gas masks now. Again, they showed this shot before a little bit, but oh, they un. Okay, they reset apparently. Oh, that was hot peppers. Wait, wait, wait. That was hot peppers. So they just like. They threw him on the ground and just, like, made everybody die. That's why they have gas masks on. That's pretty dark, I guess. Actually, I like dark. So they're just so hot. They're like, no, I don't need your booty call. 
we're just gonna kill all of you with these flames that we're bringing, I guess, is the point of the video. Which, like, there are worse ways to go. You know what I'm saying? Cool logo, by the way. This logo is very, very nice. With the smoke and, like, the... I love that. Yeah, I really liked this darker concept. I mean, like, the, their last one was, like, visually... Like, it wasn't dark, like, violent dark, but, like, musically it was definitely... But, so... Sorry, I'm I'm a little bit scatterbrained, because I'm still trying to process everything in the video and make sure it lines up with my throwing hot pepper juice and killing everybody theory. <laughs> um, musically, uh, I really liked this. At first, it... I liked it, but I wasn't sure where it was going, but those vocals came in so, so, so saucy. Like, just, man, they've got, they have very defined vocal tone in, in setting an emotion. Last time it was like, we're gonna party, lots of excited vocals. Like, yeah, they were good vocals, but like, there was this excitement there. Um, but this one... It's like, they're going for this sexy vibe, but like, no, you can't have this sexy. Like, I'm not answering your booty call. Should go away. Freaking every night you call me. What's going on? Um, but yeah, this was, this was dope. I, I like this a lot. I'm continuing to notice. So definitely it seems that when they, when they split on this, um, when they split after that six debut, and they went to this five member with uh with Solji and Hiran. Definitely, definitely um I so far I've liked everything I've heard since then. Uh so yeah, a lot more. Um this is really good. Like I said, thank you so much for watching this video. Please forgive me in butchering names and not knowing what's going on. Um stumbling over my words a little bit. Uh I really like this. I think I like the other song slightly more, but this concept was cooler and more, uh, I like the direction that it took, um, the whole time I was trying to figure out what was going on, then I finally got it, so, guys, I hope you have a lovely rest of your day, make sure, if you want to see more videos like this, you hit the subscribe button, and, uh, stay newbie.